quick screen share to show you how to set up email forwarding in Google Workspace or Google Admin email addresses. So Google requires you to set up a confirmation code that goes to the email you're forwarding to, which you have to access through gmail.com in the settings. So I'm going to go ahead and go to gmail.com. And I'll sign out real quick. So once you're signed in to gmail.com, you're going to want to go in the upper right, you're going to see a settings gear. So click on that and then go to see all settings. And you're presented with your Gmail settings here. At the top, these are different tabs. So going over from the left, you'll see forwarding and pop slash IMAP. So what you want to do is you want to add a forwarding address. So click add a forwarding address. Punch in the email address you want the forwarding to go to. It's going to say forwarding mail to the address you provided. Click proceed. And a confirmation code has been sent to the email address to verify permission. So you're going to want to go to your other email address that you're getting your forwarded mail to. Go ahead and log into that. It might not be a Gmail account, you know, it could be an AOL, Yahoo, whatever it may be. And you'll have an email saying forwarding confirmation, receive mail from. So you're going to go ahead and click that. And right here, this confirmation code few lines down you know, I want to copy that and then go back to your Gmail settings which you might have in another tab and once you're into your Gmail settings if you do have to log in again obviously you go to settings with the gear up top and click see all settings and forwarding and pop slash IMAP and then you'll have this box here that says verify and that's where you're going to want to put your confirmation code go ahead and click verify and then you actually have the option now to forward a copy so go ahead there and you're going to just want to save this because you most likely want to keep that mail in this box and just send a copy to the forwarding address so then click on save changes and forwarding is now set up. So I'm going to just test it real quick here. Test forwarding. Just sending it to myself. So I got it sent here and my Gmail inbox and then in my other account let's go ahead and check that one and there's my other account and there's the test forwarding so forwarding is set up and a copy is being kept in the original inbox